go as slow as shadow on the mic I play to win, never to lose In the contest of champions I'm the one that shoes Swipe straight down, my moves are slick Dexterity more heavily, I dodge quick Class champ, I'm the master of the game Cosmic science, skill tech mutant I claim Arena and chill grind, that's how I roll No stress, no drama, just on patrol The fight, I'm swift, my tactics excite Lost shadows in the arena, ready to ignite From the streets to the screen, my skills are renowned in the world of Marvel, I'm the King Crown. So listen up, here's the story of the champ, Lord Shadow's the name. I'm the Grind Track fan. Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So round one of Negasonic Teenage Warhead. She is in the featured, and Ghost Rider is over and done with, and we're gonna take a look at the leaderboards and we'll talk a little bit about Negasonic. Uh, but let's see here. Uh, I didn't go for her. Um, I, I'm still not sure if I want to go for her. I'm probably not. Um, grinding these days, I just don't. I'm just not up for it. Um, maybe they'll come along a champ that I'm just like, oh, no, I got to have that champion. And then I'll grind again. It's pretty much what I did with uh, Onslaught. All right. Elusive. Number one, Shasha Boom. What? Shasha Boom must have been going for that number one spot, but you got number two. I don't know if there's anything for number two, but hey. You might be happy. You might not be happy. It might just be the number one spot that uh, gets the credit. Let's see. But <laughs> I remember Ghost Rider. He's a little long in the tooth now. And I'm sure people were trying to get that number one spot because he's not, he, he wasn't going to go very high. I mean, not only is he an older champion, but you've got Cosmic Ghost Rider. And then you have Kushala, who was just in the arena. I don't see people using um, OG Ghost Rider all that much. You've got both of those. Cosmic Ghost Rider, I see. Kushala, I see. Um, I think a lot of people forgot about uh, poor Ghost Rider, but I remember. He saved me a lot of items in Alliance Quest. I used to go in with um, uh, the, Trini uh, the Trinity, um, Blade, Ghost Rider, Spider-Man, Stark Enhanced. And I only had the four stars at the time. Now, before that, it was Wolverine because he was sustainable. And I always used Wolverine uh, to save myself items. And I didn't really like Ghost Rider. But that's because without the synergy, he has a chance for his judgments to fail. I don't like that. I don't like chances to fail. So I never used him without the synergy. If you look uh, on my channel, if you can do a search for Ghost Rider, you'll see some of the old videos where I'm testing him out, playing around. There was one time I was trying to get the heel going without, you know, the blade. And it just was not, not fun. But with that Trinity, he doesn't fail. And he saved me so many items. I, In fact, I didn't use items in Alliance Quest. Once I had, um, you know, Wolverine and I had him awakened, I didn't use items. And then I transitioned over to Ghost Rider with the Trinity because I would not bring Ghost Rider in without Blade. But once I did, oh yeah. And then I just moved up. When I got a five star version and just kept going, and it took me a long time to get a five star uh, blade, but I had a five star Starkey. He was actually my first, um, what was it at the time? I'm trying to remember, I think he was my first rank five. But that's who I took into Labyrinth of Legends. And it was very, 
very expensive to do that with him. But I had saved up like 20,000 units. And I kept healing him up, which is what took a lot of the um, uh, units. And of course, the revives. And I did it in a week. Now, I could have paced myself and I wouldn't have used that many items, but I wanted to get it done. But, oh man, I do remember Ghost Rider. But now, I don't know. Healthy and happy, I see you. Dark bottom. I don't know if I want to have a dark bottom. That don't that don't sound uh pleasant. Black pink, pink Lee. What's up with the pinks? How about the pink ranger? Yeah. And I'm talking about Amy Jo Johnson, pink ranger, who says she hates the color pink. <laughs> it's so funny. Oh man. Anyway. Now let's go to the new champion, Negasonic Teenage Warhead. And CPC Boy Boy. Okay. Okay. Papetto almost got number one. Laser John. Look at that. Top three. That's what's up. All right. So now the main thing that I have seen with her is she is a hard counter to Bullseye. This is what Kabam does. It's their pattern. That's why I wasn't too worried. I saw people complaining about how difficult uh, Bullseye was. That's what they do. They come out with these crazy defenders that you have a trouble with. Then they release a hard counter for them. So now you're like, ooh, 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 I got to get that one. That's what they want. So um, I watched uh, uh, I watched her fight um, Bullseye. It's not even, it's, not, it's, it's a hard counter. He can't evade. It puts the stun on him. It, it, it's ugly. It's ugly. All right. So, yeah, he's not winning against her. Now, I also noticed that she did put some uh, incinerate, so she's going to be good for uh, any time you need an incinerate, okay? So if uh, you happen to be doing some questing and you need incinerates to stop some node buff or something like that, I think she'll be good. I think the, um, I think her, yeah, her incinerates are, are um, passive, right? Black Cat, congratulations. Yeah, I, th I think her incinerates are passive, and I, I, I guess they still count. I'm not sure. Um, but other than the hard counter to Bullseye and the incinerates and all of that, I'm not sure at this point. She's still new. So I'm not sure where I would use her outside of that. But I know she's going to be used for more than just what I mentioned. Okay, she's a hard counter to Bullseye, but I'm pretty sure she counters quite a few others as well. Um, leave a comment uh, if you know uh, some champions that she counters. Uh, maybe you'll get me to go, ooh, maybe I do need to pick her up. Not likely, but <laughs> it might. You might, you might, it might happen. All right. Grande, Aguila, or Aguila. All right. But the cutoff, I don't know. Leave a comment below and let us know what your score is. Since this is round one, it's going to help. It's going to help people. Uh, maybe they missed round one or they're just thinking about going for round two. I usually went for round two so that I could see what they went for round one. This game hates me. Okay. But you grind it out to 163. Ain't mad at that. Now, I'll tell you, I've been trying to get Bullseye, right? 
Couldn't get bullseye. Now that there's a hard counter, watch me get bullseye. Shouldn't be too long now that I get him. Now that it's not really the advantage that it was. Conspiracy. But anyway, that's going to do it for this video. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And definitely leave your score, your rank, um, who Negasonic counters that you found, and places where she can be used to great effect. Put it all in the comment section below. All right, take care, and you all have a blessed day. Arena and chill grind, that's how we roll. No stress, no drama, just on patrol. In the fight, he swift. His tactics be tight. Those shadows in the arena, ready to ignite. From the streets to the screen, his skills be renowned. In the world of Marvel, Lord, the King Crown. Oh, oh.